you have come to my channel and if you're new, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of my other videos. Well, today I'm going to try for the first time, so this is kind of first impression and review and trying out these two new products that I got. One is a foundation and one is an eye primer. The eye primer is from Pure Crease Crease Eyeshadow Primer. And this is a primer that stops creasing in the tracks for flawless smooth shadow application. And I'm very interested to try this. Uh, I already have a video that I put, I think, up last week about a eyeshadow primer or eyeshadow base. And this is from Lacan that worked kind of okay for me. I do like it, but I still want something that will hold for at least 10 11 hours. So we'll try this one. And also we are going to try a new foundation that it's called Lava Art and this is a foundation, cushion foundation that I saw on Facebook and I was so interested because it's kind of like a BB cream or CC cream but full coverage and supposed to last the whole day, have fantastic ingredients. This is a Korean brand, they only have four shades. Let me show you the website, it's on Swedish but just show you the ingredients there are four shades over there and I'll put information down below that's what it says it has 15 chamomile different nice products Strawberries, peppermint. Well, I will put the information down below, and I'm very excited. Now you do subscribe for this, and we'll give you like two packages or two foundations every second month. But you can end it whenever you want, and it comes. This is how the cushion foundation looks like and this you get two of these every second month or if you don't want don't like it you don't have to don't continue to be subscribed. This is how the packaging looks like. It's a very nice plastic and it's a hole here with a mirror and you open it like this. Get the, and you put the foundation down here. Do you like my new ears? I bought them on Wish. I'm very excited to try this. So this is how it looks. You get this beautiful cushion. And you're supposed to pad, push the foundation into the skin. Not like doing the circle ways of it up or down, down. And you put your foundation here like this. Let me take this off. That's it, that's the sound, click sound. And when, when you want to replace it with a new one, you just push it upwards. Take it up and take the new one. So let's zoom in. This is how the foundation looks like. It's, I think I had the second shade. This is number 23. They only have four shades. And you open it like this. And that's the foundation. I hope it matches my skin tone. Uh, the light one, I felt like it was too light and the others were too dark. But let's... There is the foundation. Ooh, it looks very nice on my skin. You can't even see it. Here it is. I'm very excited. So let's put some primer on. I will take the same primer that I used last time I tried the Ordinary foundation that I really really like but I forgot to shake it before I used it last time so that's something I have to remember next time I really really like this packaging really like it and the mirror is amazing in here let's start I will put three fingers here so I get it's nice and sturdy 
my mirror and let's see cut a lot and pad oh it's a nice shade oh my god do you see that coverage oh And I read on the website that you can build it up if you want to, if you want more coverage. Can you see half of my face with the foundation I have without? I think this looks amazing. Can you see? This looks so nice. Let's do the rest. is amazing can you see that coverage um i don't know what to say it looks perfect a little bit tacky i don't even think i need another coat but i will put some extra here when i have some spots or pimples and this sponge or i don't know what to call it but this is so soft and i push this product into my skin I hope you can see this but look at this coverage look here around my nose I'm really liking this foundation so far. Really, really liking this foundation. I really hope it stays at least for at least eight, nine hours because this coverage is amazing. I don't regret buying this at all. I know I just put it on on my face, but the results, the feeling, it feel my face feels so soft and moisturized and light. It's a very light foundation and. I didn't try many cushion foundations, but this this one it feels very nice. And uh, right now it feels a little bit sticky. It looks a little bit shiny. It gives a nice shine to my face. It doesn't look very oily. I don't think so. It's time to try this eyeshadow primer. Comes in this cute packaging. It's white. I don't know how much I can hear the helicopter outside. Oh, I think I put a little bit too much. Take some away feels like a thick cream I don't know how to explain it doesn't smell nice at all I'm going to finish my makeup put some eyeshadow on and some bronzer and uh, concealer to set this foundation and right now it's 10.49 and see you soon so my makeup is done and with my phone and it's 11.05 let's zoom in so you can see this is the eye look and I have the primer on and this is the foundation I'm loving it I love the primer, I love the foundation I hope it lasts whole day 
and I'll do some check-in. makeup on for at least 11 hours kind of 10 11 hours the only thing that I put on right now it's the lipstick the I didn't touch my makeup at all let's see how it looks after 11 hours as you can see my eyeshadow is gone it creased a lot and I don't like how it looks now I had a lot of my uh, mascara transforming down here so I was like cleaning under my eyes so that's why I don't have any foundation or concealer under there but if you look at my foundation it looks very nice. Now here around my nose it was itching so I was touching my nose a lot but look the rest of my face. So I have to say that I don't like this primer. I really don't. I didn't, don't think it worked. I had after I think four hours it start my eyeshadow start fading, and after five six it was like this creased, and I don't like it. Doesn't look good. So I will try it again. Now this foundation I really really love. I love the color of it. I know it's only four shades, but the second shade, number 23, matches me perfectly. I really, really like this foundation. I do kind of look a little bit oily, but it's just because it's very hot outside. And let's try to use this matte blocking paper and see if it takes off my makeup or foundation. take a little bit of my foundation but it still looks very nice I'm definitely going to continue using it because it's so good it almost reminds me of my Estee Lauder double wear I'll put all the information down below if you want to check this out it costs 298 Swedish crowns and it's around 34 dollars and you they do send this every second month now the first time you buy this, you will receive the two new cushion compact after 14 days. And of course if you don't want it, if you don't like it when you get it, you can email them and say I'm not interested in continue getting this foundation and you won't get it. But if you like it, they will send it to you. And uh, I think that I will continue getting this. Uh, every second month because I really really like this foundation and I don't know how long this will last me I don't know how much you get here or well, you do 15 15 grams made in Korea and it does have e SPF 50 so this is good it has S SPF 50 that was everything I had for you today thank you so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't and see you soon in my next video bye